Hi, this is Appreciating Learning Channel. Today's video is going to be quick. This is in regards to Angular on Toggle menu icon display perhaps a different icon, right? For now, I'm using Bootstrap and this is what it's showing for now. If I toggle on it, everything works as expected. But let's say going forward, you would like to change this menu icon to a different icon of choice, right? So um, let's dive right into the coding aspect so we see how we can go about this by having to change um, the menu icon right so um, first thing I would like to what what I'm going to do right in this quick video is to first define our boolean variable right and uh, let me see let me minimize this okay so this is the photo structure in Angular, I mean the app component HTML file, and this is the TS file where basically the functions, the functionality is going to be right. Defining of the functionality, right? So, first, I'll like to define our Boolean variable. So, by doing so, I'll say I I'm going to give it a Boolean and I'll say force, right? So this is done. I like to, for us to define our function, right? And then by defining our function, we head back again to the same .ts file. Then I would like to say toggle menu right there. Okay. And then I can say this dot i toggle it, right? Let's go to. So this basically means, right, um, as you can see, we already um, defined this or declared this, right, as um, false, right? So we're saying, okay, if this is false, then let it be true. That's pretty much it, right? So now let's save it and then let's head back to the HTML file. Okay, and let me just minimize this right here. So this is it, this is the HTML file, and then uh, for now we are using the bootstrap, right, um, Nava toggle icon, right, so for now let me just comment this out, and then once we head back, this is going to vanish, right, this is going to vanish, okay, and then for now we would like to incorporate our own icon, right, so by doing so we can, let me head back again, um by doing so okay, this is done let me just put it for now okay so by doing so I like to say i papa okay arrow down okay and like to duplicate this say arrow up let's save it for now okay so this is what we have okay and this is not working as expected this isn't the goal right the goal is to once you click on this only one icon should display and once you click on it again only one icon should display right okay so um, like I said we're gonna move on to the third which is to add a click event on the button in the app.component.html file so we're gonna come right here like so and then add a click event so we would like to say on click event let's call our function right we would like to call our function right here toggle menu like so right click it and then head back again it's, of course it's not going to work there's one more thing that we need to do right which is of course the last part add if condition to display the arrow up and down icon okay so to do so all we have to do in here is to just ng if right like so so if it's really this um, if it's the eye toggle right then display this arrow down right let's copy this and bring it down and then in here, I'd like to add a not, right? So this is always going to be true, and this is always going to be false. Okay, 
let's save it and head back and see the changes okay so once we click on it our arrow icon changes click on it it changes and that's pretty much it thank you guys for tuning in let me know if you're having any difficulties or you're still not able to get this um, you know function as expected as always don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button thank you